Assalamualaikum and a very good day to all of you. I am Muzatira and today we are starting a new unit, unit 5. Okay, and the title for today's lesson is science. Okay, so some of these things you already know in Malay, you dah belajar in subject science. Cuma sekarang is more to how do we talk about these things in English. First, we will do some reading. Okay, we will read a museum guide. And then we will finish like three uh, more exercises about this text study. Now, what is a museum guide? Museum guide in Malay is macam panduan museum like that. When you go into museum, there is a text yang explain what uh, those things are about. Okay, now don't worry. Let's look at the example. Okay, so now we are going to visit a science museum. Okay, museum science, right? So, dia cakap tu nak kat sini, explore the world and have fun. Right. Now, dalam museum ni, the science museum, there are a lot of parts. Ada macam-macam bahagian. The first part is this one. Who am I? Okay, ni dia punya satu bahagian. Nama dia, who am I? Find out how your DNA makes you different from other people and how a scientist would make a clone of you. Okay, so dekat sini you can learn about DNA. Okay, so DNA ni, you dah belajar dalam science kan? My DNA and your DNA is different. Okay, dia benda yang membuatkan your hair color, your eye color is different. Okay, and then how a scientist will make a clone of you. So kalau, let's say a scientist wants to make um, an exact copy of you, alright, dia kena guna your DNA. Barulah keluar dua orang yang sebijik macam ni. Next, kita ada food of the future. Makanan masa hadapan. Millions of people around the world go hungry every day. Berjuta-juta-juta orang uh, are hungry every day. But, okay, but dia tanya, are genetically modified crops really the answer? Crops ni maksudnya tanaman. Okay, adakah? So, dia tanya, adakah tanaman yang di... Uh, ubah secara genetik ini adalah the jawapannya. Okay. Now, some of the examples of genetically modified crops are this one. Like bananas. Dulu-dulu bananas are like this. Okay. And then, scientists were like, Susahnya nak makan ni. How are we going to eat this? There are so many seeds. Biji dia banyak sangat. Okay. So, they change. They try to change the genes. Okay. Genetiknya. Until we have a pretty one like this one. Macam sekarang. Okay, we can enjoy bananas without the seed. And also we have um, watermelons. Another example is before this, it was like this, you know. Like, tak ada banyak flesh. Tak ada banyak isi. But now, we can enjoy all the flesh. Next. Okay, next part. Kita pergi museum uh, pasal the secrets of medicine. Rahsia ubat-ubatan. Okay. How does a scientist find a cure for a disease. Macam mana scientist ni cari cure, penawar, for a disease, penyakit. Okay, and how can a vaccine stop you from getting ill? Uh, vaccine macam sekarang. Macam mana vaccine boleh tolong kita daripada getting COVID-19? Right? Learn the answers to these questions and more. Okay, dia cakap kita akan belajar banyak lagi pasal ni bila you masuk bahagian ni. Okay. For example, this is a vaccine, sorry, this is a virus or can be a disease also. Alright, and then we're getting a vaccine here. Next, kita ada pasal journey into space. Perjalanan ke angkasa. Kita cakap experience space in 3D in our amazing IMAX cinema. Okay, in case ada yang lupa dah lama kita COVID ni, kita dah, dah lama tak pergi cinema kan? Cinema is panggung wayang. Okay, so... This thing is like panggung wayang but it's like 3D. Travel by spacecraft to the planet Mars. Okay, spacecraft means uh, this thing, kapal angkasa. To the planet Mars, okay. And see the view from a satellite flying around the Earth. Okay, then boleh tengok pemandangan daripada satellite. This is an example of a satellite yang terbang mengelilingi bumi. Okay, like how does it look like from up there? And I think this is the last one. Then we have healthy earth. Okay, did you got watch a wind turbine and a solar panel make electricity and see what happens to a battery 
when you throw it away. Uh, watch a wind turbine. This one is wind turbine. Uh, in Malay, it's called kinci angin. And then we have a solar panel. Okay, these two things, they make electricity from natural resources. Sumber, uh, semula jadi. All right. Now, done. Now that we are done reading tadi, it is time to choose your preference. Uh, kita dah belajar hari tu preference. What does it mean by preference? Asal daripada perkataan prefer. Hmm, preference. Choosing your favorite. Now for this part, exercise 2, tengok dulu dia cakap, which part of the museum would you like to visit? Okay, antara banyak-banyak ni, mana satu you nak visit? Tengok eh. The answer should be, I would like to visit, apa dia? Because, you need to tell me the reason why. Right? I would like to visit which one? Dekat sini. Uh, we have, okay, five tadi kan? We have, who am I? And then we have, journey into space. We have, Food of the future, and then healthy earth, and then the secrets of medicine. So which one do you want uh, to go to? Which one you, you think is paling best lah? Okay, let's say, let's say you berminat pasal secrets of medicine. Okay, so right now, I would like to visit the secrets of medicine because, okay, I forget. Right, that's it. Now. Moving on to the next part. Okay, next part, exercise three. You check out copy and complete the table with the correct words from exercise one. Okay, tidak bagi you satu contoh. Space is spacecraft. Okay, now tidak bagi you three things: space, medicine, and then environment. Okay, space means uh, angkasa. Medicine means ubat. Environment means uh, alam sekitar. Okay, now you look at the text again. Alright, so all these texts, you need to look at the words in blue. Okay, can you see the words in blue? Can you see this one? Can we have DNA, clone, spacecraft, planet, uh, semua ni in blue ni. You need to put it into category. For example, vaccine. Okay, vaccine. Is it about space? Pasal angkasa ke? Ada kaitan dengan angkasa ke vaksin? Okay. Is it about medicine? Ada kaitan dengan ubat-ubatan ke? Or is it about the environment? Okay. So, I think vaccine is here. So, I'm going to write down the word. Vaccine. Okay. So, you do uh, the rest of the words also. Tengok dekat kategori mana does it belong to. Alright. So, we're done. Yang ni very simple. Okay. This part is where you ask questions. Alright, now, sudah. Ask questions about apa pula? Tengok exercise 4. What do you want to know about science in the future? Ah, dia tanya you. You nak tahu apa pasal science in the future? Masa depan nanti. Write one question for each of the subheadings in exercise 3. Okay, exercise 3 tadi we have these. Okay, we have like three different subheadings. We have space, medicine, and environment. And then, dia cakap, write one question each. Okay, each. Maksudnya, uh, space, you have one. Medicine, you have one question. Environment, also, you write down one question. Okay, satu soalan each. For example, uh, regarding space. Pasal angkasa, I want to know, will people live on the moon? Adakah kita akan hidup? Dekat bulan. Okay. So, things that you want to know. So, you just write down here. Medicine. What do you want to know about the future of medicine and the environment? Write down lah. Only one each. Okay. Very simple. That's it. Okay. So, just now we have read a museum guide. Dah settle. Okay. Exercise. Sorry. Number two. You just choose one preference. Which one do you want to visit? Dalam museum tu. Okay, and then you categorize the words in blue into three different uh, subheadings. We have space, medicine, and then environment. And then you ask three questions about the three subheadings. Okay, so that's all for today. Very simple, Joe. If you have any questions, you can ask me here or in our Telegram group. Okay, that's all. Thank you for listening. Bye-bye.